Good night, well, it's nine o'clock. So today I'm making Today I am making what? Today I'm making a video late at night. Today I'm making a video late in the evening. Sorry guys, I woke up late today. I woke up and like slept until 8. Because I went to bed like around 11 o'clock. So I'm just going to make a quick 30 minute video here. And I will what? And I will make a uh, quick 30 minute video. Today I'll make a quick 30 minute video. I'll make a quick 30 minute video. Make a quick video. Only a 30 minute video because it's late and it might take away the cord soon. We're gonna take away the cord soon, most likely. So, the cord was here the past couple days, but just in case, I'm gonna make a quick 30 minute video. And I'm gonna talk about Zanus. My book, Zanus. I'm gonna make my book Zanus. <clears throat> Talk about my book Zanus and my, my, my movie adaption I'm gonna make off my book. If you hear the noise, you have to excuse the noise. My uh, step parents are listening to music upstairs. So you're gonna have to excuse the noise, guys. I hope you guys all have a happy holiday. I suppose we had a good Christmas, right? With my supposed family, obviously. I hope you guys enjoyed your... Uh... Enjoyed your uh, Christmas. And I hope you have a happy holidays. And I hope you have a happy New Year's. New Year's is in a good, like, four days, right? Yeah, New Year's Eve is in four days. So I hope you guys enjoy your, your New Year's Eve. And New Year's Eve, I might see Avatar 2 on theaters. Or Black Panther, Wakanda Forever. I don't know. I'll see either of those movies. Um, yeah. Go to the uh, Cineplex in the Hull, Quebec. It's like a 15 mile. I'll ask my step parents if they can give me a ride there. Or not. if not, I'll just bust there. I'll see it on my own or with my younger step brother. Go to the theaters, buy my 3D ticket. I'm going to see it on 3D, 3D, obviously. I'm going to get nice... Uh... Yeah. Get some nice popcorn. Nice popcorn, nice stuff. Get some nice uh, popcorn, candy, and like a drink for myself.
Yeah. So Zanus, once I pay this bull, I don't know, 2024 should be the year I pay the fee. It's coming soon, guys. Yeah, 2024 should be the year I pay that this fee, this bullshit fee. And once I find out how wicked my step family is and you guys, I'm taking my money and I'm going to cry my heavy tears. I'll be a bit happy, obviously, and excited because I know I'm going to be king after this. I know I have to have sex with my own stepmother, which is not fun, obviously. She's gonna, yeah. I, if you want your wife fresh, you gotta have sex with me because you, the, the, my step parents will be hard with the people, pussy. Which I don't want to do, and I also have to be a porn star, and I have to die to save my wife. If I don't die, Victoria Justice will never see me from there. If I don't die, Victoria Justice will never see me. And that's why you guys trap me with the choice. Oh, yeah, even, even Either you run off, you sell and share with your wife, or you die and have your wife fresh yourself when your wife sees. If you want, if Vijay, if Vijay wants to see the light, you have to die for it. Otherwise, Victoria Justice will never see the light. So saying she'll see hell forever. And I'm gonna, I choose death, obviously, and I cry my heavy tears, and I pay this fee. And then once I wake up, my debt is now paid. You guys got your sex from my Romero. All members, <coughs> all members of my step family, they all, they all want to bang my wife. <coughs> and I guarantee you I'm going to be having sex with members of my step family, too. It's finally going to hit my mind. Like, once I, I don't know, once all these, like, people in my family line that assess me, it's finally going to hit my mind. Holy shit, these people are blind, man. They're blinded by their envy, man. Of wanting me and VJ. Yeah, it's so demonic. This envy that you guys have with me and VJ is so demonic that what? That you guys are blind, obviously, by your envy. Like my own, think about it, my own stepmother who gave birth to me wants to have sex with me, man. That's how fucked up this place is, man. Yeah, man. If 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 I gave birth to someone who was God, even no matter how attractive he is, I wouldn't I wouldn't force him to have sex with me. It's fucked up, man. And she wants to have sex with me, man. Because you guys are fucking crazy people. All members of my family all probably all had sex with me. They all want VJ too. Yeah, and VJ's family. They all they're all gonna be lined up to have sex with me too. Guaranteed. Guaranteed, I'm gonna be lined up to have sex with VJ's sister. Her stepmother, my stepmother, my cousins, and like they're all gonna be lying on that sassy. It's finally gonna hit my mind on my aunts. And I'm like, holy shit, these guys are blind. They all they're all lined up to have sex with I me. Mean, this is fucked up. Yeah. That's why once I pay this, we got piece of the fuck out of this. Yeah, man. Yeah, and I wake up from Zen. And I'm in that room, I, for the day I about to die, I cry heavy tears, VJ's crying, I'm just, uh, I'm just, just crying, and I cry heavy, heavy tears, obviously, you know what I'm saying, and I'm, all I have to do is just wake up one second later, one minute later, you know when you sleep, next second you're, you pass out, one second you wake up, yeah. Yeah, you one second you wake up. The next second you what? One second you wake up. The next second you uh, you're you're one second you're you die. Next second you wake up. And I wake up in a hospital, and I'm like, oh my god, I got that over it. And once I wake up, I'm guaranteed gonna cry, weep in tears. But I just came back from death, man. You know, so in the moment I come from death, VJ when I'll see the light. That day, that day when she goes to bed, she when I'll see the light. But my guess is the moment I wake up, that's when VJ sees the light, obviously. When I die, VJ will still see hell. When I wake up, the debt's paid, obviously. VJ can VJ gets her healing in her vagina, whatever it is. She's nice and fresh now, and she can now see the light when she drinks. And, the, and now, once you see the light, now you stop crying. Because VJ's fucking crazy, man. Oh, my God. Yeah, I have a mental illness, obviously, and I think crazy things. I trip. I think psychotic things. I think crazy things, obviously. I mean, Tori Justice is crazy, man. She cries every fucking night, man. And now when I, you see the light, I suffer death. Now you don't cry anymore. She's fucking evil, man. Yeah, man. Oh. Yo, know, Ivan, thank you for dying for me. Now you have to deal with my mess. I see the light. I'm not going to cry to you anymore. She's fucking crazy, man. Yeah, man. From Sarah? Yeah. And I 
say my final 30 day goodbyes. I'm going to talk a bit about this. I like talking about this. I'll talk a bit about Zanus, obviously. I'm going to say my final 30 day goodbyes, obviously. And what? And I come home, my step family are all, they all weep in tears. Oh, I even forgive me. I'm sorry. If everything they did to me will hit them. Oh my God. We, we separate. I meet you for 30 years. We caused that mess. Because you guys know how bad the mess is, obviously. Because VJ has the key, so you know how bad her mess is, obviously. I don't know how bad her mess is. VJ does not know how bad my mess is, but you guys will know how bad my mess is because we both have the keys. And it was in acting like VJ's and my wife locked in all the words. Falling going to hit your minds. Holy shit, we're wicked people, man. We did, like, everything we did. We, we, after causing that mess, we went to and VJ to share. Yeah, because you're crazy people, obviously. And then some of you guys in the world will cry. Not everyone in the world will cry, but guaranteed some people in the world are going to shed tears once I come back, once I come from death. Because everything you did, was good. what you did is so demonic and so evil that like, if, if you were, if you were, if you were the same person, you would cry, man. If I did this to somebody, man, I would, I would break down in tears. I'm, please forgive me. I'm so sorry. See what I'm saying? Yeah. When you guys are blinded by envy, hence why you guys don't, you're not crying now. But once I come out from death, you're finally going to, your, your your eyes will be open. And you're going to see what you did to me, Vijay. You're going to weep in tears, man. Oh my God, we're wicked. Especially my the step parents, man. The step families, they're going to weep in tears. Oh, Vijay, please forgive me. Ivan, please forgive me. I'm sorry. Oh, Ivan, I'm sorry. Oh, oh you're going to see her cry out heavy tears. Is that? Look, man, you can cry heavy tears all you want. You're wicked people. You're not going to be safe. You're going to be left behind, man. I'm not gonna save you after you just me. You're fucking crazy. You just killed me, and you you forced me to have sex with my stepmother and members of my own family, and you what? You caused that fucked up mess. And you, and you and you act like I watched myself on my Savage Jew channel. You did this evil to me. You're gonna pay a price too. You're left behind. You're not saved. But you guys are wicked people. You don't serve to be saved, since Sarah. The only way I will save you, world, after what you did to me, is if you put the stats on. If you put the stats on, I'll allow you make. I'll have a nice, nice setup in my in my car and everything. I'll make videos for you, which are, which you're not gonna do. Hence, I'm not making videos. We gotta deserve them. I want to see the billion views. Some Sarah. Yeah, and during those thirty days, I'll be experiencing fame, obviously, in Elmer and Ottawa. Elmer, I'll be, I'll be going. The leftover money I'll have, I'll go to the Elmer bar, have a beer there. I might say hi to some of the old, uh, one, some of the old bartenders. <laughs> Maybe they, they might be new bartenders by then, but the chances are that some of the old bartenders who I, who I'm familiar with, I'm gonna say hi to them. They all know who I am, obviously. I'm saying, Ivan, you know, it's nice to see you, you know, what I'm saying. I say hi to them, and then I'm going to be experiencing fame. Fans are going to ask me for pictures. Fans are going to ask me for pictures. Fans are going to ask me for pictures. <laughs> Fans are going to ask me for pictures. Fans are going to ask me for pictures fans are going to ask me for pictures and what you're going to see some of that trending on twitter yeah it's going to be crazy obviously and uh yeah I'm gonna go to the Depreneur, the Wolf of Levine Depreneur. I recommend you guys in Elmer check out the Wolf of Levine Depreneur. They have cheaper beers. The be some of the some of the beers at the Ultramar are the same price as the beers in the Depreneur. But Depreneur has cheaper smoke. So all you guys who smoke, the Depreneur I believe is a, has the cheapest like smokes in, 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 in Elmer, man. One of the cheapest smokes in Elmer. The one in the Ultramar in in the, in the Main Street Elmer, obviously. And the one year bill, those 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 stores are more expensive than the Depreneur Wolf Levine. Definitely, Depreneur Wilfred Levine has has cheaper beer, cheaper beer, cheaper smokes, on average, right? It's pretty much the same price, but they have cheaper smokes and cheaper beers. So all you guys who like beer and smokes, they have. I recommend you check it out. You're welcome. Run your store out there. I'll go there, Elmer Bar, and I'll clean up my room. 
um, get rid of all my old clothes because now I know I'm going to get that check. I can get my used wardrobe of clothes, obviously. And you're going to see me trending on Twitter. And then once the 30 days are up, okay, Ivan, you release your book on, on I'm going to have to get my set parents to, to hire someone to help me release my book. So whenever I pay this fee, okay, once I pay this fee, I want you to hire someone to help me release my book on Lulu. Yeah, right, we do that for you. Yeah, they do that for me, obviously. And the 30 days go by, and I get my, I don't know, I get my check midnight. Midnight on the 30th of that month, I get my check. I'm sleeping, and I wonder how much I got paid, you know what I'm saying? And I'm sleeping, and I wonder how much I got paid. I'm, I'm curious. I wonder how much money I got paid. You know what I'm saying? And I, I look at my check, and it says like ten point five billion dollars. I see the ten, I see the nine zeros. I'm like, holy shit! I got ten point five billion dollars. I'm richer than all these Hollywood celebrities, all these sport athletes. Yeah, all these. I'm richer than the majority of all the billionaires around the world. Richer than Mark Cuban, Donald Trump. I'm richer than the majority of the billionaires. Most of the billionaires around the world are only worth a couple of billion dollars. The rarities are worth like their tens of billions. But I'm richer than the majority of the billionaires in the world. Yeah. And all these Hollywood celebrities. I'm like, holy shit, I'm rich. You know what I'm saying? And if I get the check midnight, obviously, that night I'm going to go to like McDonald's and just fucking celebrate, man. I'm going to go. I might even go to the bar when I get that check. I'm going to go to the bar and I might, I might go to the bar and maybe go to the bar maybe that night. The day I know I'm going to get my check, that'll be the day I'll get, like, 12 beers. So instead of going to the bar, I'll just get 12 beers. And if I get that check, I get the check. I'm going to go to, like, McDonald's. Go to McDonald's and get, like, uh, get, like, some, some, some nice food and celebrate. And I might watch maybe, I don't know, maybe VJ's movies. We'll watch some of VJ's movies, obviously. So what I'll do is once I get my check, obviously, my step parents will be like, hey, Ivan, you got your money. Get out of the house. You, you, you can get out of the house now. You have money now. You can live your life. Get out of the house. Yeah, I'm peacing now. I'm getting out of the house, obviously. I'll stay hold here for probably a good two days once I get the check. Um, or I might leave early the next morning. Obviously. And I'll put my TV... Outside in the lawn for someone to take. Someone will take my TV, obviously. And I'm gonna head head to the shadow, uh, head to the dentist, have a nice bite to eat. And I'm gonna go to the Chateau Cartier and have a uh, uh, book my my hotel. Book my hotel for ten days. Book my hotel for 10 days. Book it for 10 days. And I'm going to go to Ottawa, get my clothes. Get a nice one body of body, one, one bottle of body wash. And um, get my teeth cleaned, obviously. Get, get, I'm not, I'll just get like Dior. I'm not going to get cologne. Cologne, I'll buy it when I do my shopping with video. I'll just get a cologne uh, deodorant. And I, if I buy cologne, I'll buy like a cheaper cologne, like maybe a forty dollar cologne. I'll buy at the store something a cheaper cologne. That way, I smell pretty good when I meet BJ, obviously. And then I'm going to what? Book my flight, my private flight to Los Angeles after the ten days to see my wife, obviously. Obviously, I guarantee I mean, you're gonna see fans uh, taking pictures of me and and, and uh, from, uh, from my uh, you're gonna see that trying online. Because now they all, by in a month, the whole world would have read my book. And so I'm going to experience fame when I go shopping in Ottawa, all that stuff. Because I'm now king, I'm there. And everyone in my life will begin to feel like shit. All my, my step family will feel like shit, obviously. BJ step family will begin to feel like shit when they see me trending. Oh, holy shit, so cool seeing Ivan trending. Because you guys have seen VJ trending many, many times, right? Because uh, he's a Hollywood celebrity. 
you're finally going to see Ivan trending behind the scenes. In Ottawa, Elmer, yeah, some some of those trends. You know, once I meet Vijay, that's when you're really going to see the trends trending on Twitter. Something crazy. Everyone who knew my life looked like shit, obviously. Look at Ivan. Ivan's a billionaire now. He made his $10.5 million. Guarantee some people will ask me, oh, Ivan, how much money did you make off your book? I'm like, look, man, it's only your business. I'm not telling you. I don't want you feeling like shit. You guys all work your asses off. Don't hate me for what? For for fifty thousand, like all these guys, man, who I went to school with, man, they all they all went they all went to school. They worked hard. You know what I'm saying they got their they got their pretty good grades or good grades. You know what I'm saying, and and they went to university. They spent thousands of dollars. You know what I'm saying to, 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 for university, obviously. They all got degrees. They all got diplomas, certificates, trade certificates, all that stuff, and they all work their asses off for fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, hundred thousand dollars a year. Ivan has the keys, his stupid annoying keys, obviously. And he made his easy time of finding dollars. Hence why keep, uh, keep the what? Keep how, the amount of money you made to yourself as these people can get very, very envious. And say, so, you know, yeah, if, if, if I tell them I made 10 for five dollars, they know with that kind of money I can live the dream life, the dream celeb life. Ivan can buy his own jets. You know what I'm saying? He can buy his, he can afford any clothes, any kind of clothes. Yeah, clothes are all pocket change. I can go to the mall. I can literally, I can literally go to the mall with VJ and get whatever clothes I want, man. I can spend like 50, 20 grand in one day in clothes. These guys can't kind of afford to pay that kind of money. Can't afford to do that. They only spend maybe three hundred bucks on clothes, one one pair of pants, one pair of shirt, and that's it. And when they get the next check, they buy more clothes. That's how they build the wardrobe. Me, I can get like I can spend twenty grand in one day on clothes. Pocket change, there. I can lease my Ferrari, my Jeep, my Porsche. These guys can't afford that kind of car. I can build my favorite in a condo. I can travel around the world, fly, fly privately. I can, I can stay at nice suites. These guys can't afford that. Hence why I keep it to yourself. Because they can get envious, man. Trust me. They can get very, very. They can get very, very envious, I'm Sarah. I remember, yeah, I remember this guy who I went to the RC with. He knows who he is, obviously. He's my, he was a pretty good friend of mine. I slept over his house. I hung out with him quite a bit. You know what I'm saying? Um, he has, like, he does electricity trades. He has a good, like, he probably makes, like, a hundred grand a year, that guy. He bought his own nice, beautiful house in Vancouver. He's married with kids and all that stuff. And I remember he told me, he's like, yeah, yeah, I bought my own house. He's like, what do you do? I'm like, I, I'm like, I work at Chorus. And I remember I was a bit envious. I'm like, oh, man, this guy's lucky. You know what I'm saying? He bought his own beautiful house. He's making like 80, 90, 100K a year. And I'm making like 600 bucks every two weeks. I felt like shit, obviously. And I was a bit envious, obviously. Well, if I can get envious for that guy, imagine me what? Imagine me making 10 of my dollars and all these guys work their asses off to make 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100K a year. And I made my 10 of my dollars. You know what I'm saying? You can get envious, obviously. Because guaranteed once I get that check, once I get that check and I go to Dindy's, I guarantee the waiters at Dindy's might give me dirty stairs and that kind of stuff. Because they work hard just to make 30, 35k a year. That's why I give the waiter a nice, like, 250, 300, $400 tip. That way, you know what I'm saying? Considering you're a billionaire, you can easily afford to give her. I can now afford to give waiters nice tips. Like, $500, $400 tips. Since I earn, yeah. When I go to the hotel, people, when I go to Ottawa and I go shopping, some people might give me dirty looks because they, they, they all work hard to make 50k a year, man. I made my easiest time of my dollars. That's why I keep it to yourself. I, people can get envious, I'm sorry. Uh, they can get very, very envious. If I met a Hollywood celebrity and the Hollywood celebrity was, and I saw him living that life, I'd be a bit envious. Because uh, these, these people are all fucking rich. They're all rich people, yeah. The, I told you, the average person envies. The Hollywood celebrity's uh, wealth, obviously. Whereas the Hollywood celebrities envy the average person's freedom. That's the difference between the two groups of people, obviously. They envy it a little bit. Like, at the end of the day, people don't really... Pe most people will do it for money. But they obviously envy the average person a little bit. Because the average person at least has freedom. But they don't have the kind of money these celebrities have. The celebrities have the money, but they don't have the freedom. The average person does not have the money, but they have the freedom. That's what I'm saying, Once I go, I do a little bit of shopping, and I'm going to save my clothes shopping when I'm with VJ. I'm going to do a little bit of shopping in uh, in Ottawa. And then 
and I'm going to take off privately to Van to Vancouver. Uh, sorry, to, to Los Angeles. If I ran off, I would take off privately to Vancouver. I'm going to take off privately to Los Angeles, obviously, to see my wife. And the reason will ask me, Ivan, how much money did you get paid? I'm saying, I'm like, yeah, Vijay, I got paid $10,500. I was like, oh my God, you got paid this much money? I'm like, yeah. Holy shit, Ivan, that's a lot of money. We can live a life with that kind of money, Ivan. I'm like, yes, we can. Son. You can what? Build that 300 in our condo. Like, Ivan, you want to build that 300 in our condo on top of the roof? Yes, let's do it, BJ. You know what I'm saying? And we can go clothes shopping. Get our nice clothes. Buy our two jets. Buy our yachts. Buy our nice cars. Get our nice cars. Okay, BJ, what car do you want to get? I don't know, Ivan. I'll see what car I want to get. She might get a Lamborghini, she might get a BMW, and she might get a nice I don't know, SUV for herself. I'll get a Jeep Porsche and a Ferrari. And then down the road, I'll buy my Bugatti. Like $18 million Bugatti, yeah. None of these guys who I knew in my life are going to be living that kind of life. Hence why I keep it to yourself, man. Because guarantee when I go to the Elmer Bar, I might run into some Darcy people. I ran into a few Darcy people before. When I go to the Elmer Bar, during those 30 days... I might run into some Darcy people. Like, hey, I have a register book. Can I have a picture of you? I'm like, yeah, sure. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And some of them can get envious, obviously, because they all, those guys all make 50, 60K a year. And I mean, my easy, I'm going to make my easy time. Yeah, we know Ivan's going to get that fat check. Yeah. You know, like he made his easy billions. Yeah, whereas we can't make that kind of money. Yeah, man. That's why I keep your lips sealed. Keep your lips sealed. Keep your lips sealed, Sarah. Keep your lips sealed. And then once I meet Vijay in Los Angeles, you're going to see me trying with Vijay. I go clubbing with her, trying pictures, me making out my wife, obviously. I, uh, we're going to go to Vancouver. We're going to make plans for the condo, the yacht, the jets, clothes shopping, building 300 in our condo, obviously. Registering for our cards, going clothes shopping, and then we're, I'm going to call those rules. I'm going to plan Sky Source Entertainment with Victoria Justice. Um, register for the business, for taxes, create a business account, $1 billion, $20 million towards the movie. Building that ground of love like property. And what? Doing all that stuff. That's what I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to have a doc team film all that. Behind the scenes of all that. And you will be excited for that doc obviously. That doc trailer. You're going to be excited for that doc trailer. You're going to be excited for that doc trailer, obviously. You're going to be excited for that doc trailer. Yeah. Then I'm going to hire my two directors. I have to compete for the job. Um, it's either going to be Peter Jackson or Mel Gibson. Peter, I'll pay him his $85 million, $450 million. Mel Gibson, $170. $56 million. Salary. And whoever's chosen now will be the chosen director. And I'm going to be planning out, I'm going to be, I'm going to, be, I'm going to begin the project for the last of the movie project. Co-writing the script, making all the business calls for the main things, obviously. Signing the Pacific Room in the first year. Um, have, have the actors come and read for the part. So first year I'll fly in all the, all the actors I'm thinking of to my office to come and read. That way I make, I made sure I made the right choice. Because you can't just choose a fucking actor. You have to make sure you you, you, you made the right choice. I'm, I'm also going to have Keanu Reeves and Scarlett Johansson them coming. No, Keanu Reeves and 
Scott Johnson I don't have to come and read because they're bigger A's actors. But for Zanius, I want I want to make make sure I chose the right actors. And that's why I make sure you have all your stars come and and read. Come in and read. And Sarah. And then second year I'll fly in the stars. Avon Joja, I'll have a little jar of picking him up at his house. Because he lives in Vancouver. All he was all the other actors will be flown into Vancouver. So I'll fly in the the first like eleven actors, twelve actors the first day on my jet. And they're gonna sign their cons. So Carl Urban, John Maega, Avon Joje. Well, Javon Joje won't fly him in. Ariana Grande, Yel Manette, Dijimon Su, Don Cheadle, Idris Alba, Angelina Bassett, Andy Circus. You know what I'm saying? John Rice Davis, the actor for Aritat, obviously. Those guys I'm flying in the first day. I'll fly in a good like 12, 12 of the stars. In a good three days, I would have signed all my actors. I sign all the stars, obviously, and then I take them out to a nice dinner. And they party it up in my nice condo. Obviously, you're going to see that trending online, obviously. Yeah, peace out, guys. You're going to see that trending online. You're going to see that trending. Trending online. You're going to see that trending online. You're going to see that trending online, yeah. That's why my scars is coming with the best brand in the industry, yeah. It's going to be a top notch company. Shut this camera in a good minute. Only I'm only going to make a 30 minute video, guys. It's late. Um, I'm only going to make a quick video. I want to enjoy my beer. And, uh, yeah, I want to enjoy my beer. That's why I'm only going to make a, uh, I'm only going to make a quick what? Yeah. How so much guys come with the best man in the industry? Yeah, and all these actors are lucky. They're going to experience that fame and success with me and VJ. Yeah, well, you guys are all left behind. You're not safe, obviously. Yeah. Anyways, guys, I am done with this video. I'm going to upload this video. Enjoy the video with you guys. I would have I'm signing out. Peace.